Happy Friday, Warriors. I'm Joseph. And I'm Skylin. And, and welcome, welcome to, to the, the Big Show. show. Here's your PHS announcements. If you need a letter of recommendation from your counselor, they will provide 10 working days to provide it. Want to know what clubs are today? Creative Writing in D134. French Club in D250. Key Club at D127. Pause in D224. The Garden Club at B146. If you are interested in playing softball this year, tryouts are December 10th to December 13th from 2.30 to 4.30. If you have not turned in your, a stamp copy of your clearance form to the office, please make sure to take care of that. See Roseanne. Please wear athletic clothing, bring a glove, and water. Good luck. Did you know Pearl Harbor happened today in 1941? Really? Okay. Let's ask Patriot about it and see if they actually pay attention in history. Hi, I'm Leroni. I'm Justin. And I'm Emily. And, and this, this is Ask, ask Patriot. Patriot. What happened on December 7th, 1941? Pearl Harbor. What happened on December 7th, 1941? Um, it was the event of Pearl Harbor. That's all I got. <laughs> what happened on December 9th, 7th, 1941? That was Pearl Harbor, wasn't Pearl it? Harbor. Yeah, Pearl Harbor. What happened on December 7th, 1941? I don't know. <laughs> what happened? What happened on December 7th, 1941? Uh, that was the day that Pearl Harbor, Harbor, Harbor happened. The day that will live in infamy. What happened on Dece December 7th, 1941? I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you that question. I, I wasn't even born, huh? <laughs> December 7th, 1941 is known as the day that will live in infamy due to the fact that the attack on Pearl Harbor took place that day. The location was a U.S. naval base stationed near Honolulu, Hawaii. Damages were very severe, costing the lives of nearly 2,400 people, including civilians and damaging eight U.S. Navy battleships, four of them which were sunk. Today there is a memorial there to remember all those we have lost in the surprise attack. Do you know how to rap or have poems? Try Cypher. Don't like no. Sneak this us, that's that. Don't like no. Don't like like. Don't like like. A snitch. Bang, bang, bang. So the only time you ever call me was when you're feeling like, don't nobody else want to listen. When's the last time you saw me? You probably don't remember that, because that was back when you were different. I don't want to hear the sorries. I'm tired of the talking. To be honest, I would rather see you different. Say you passed me in the hallway, but you wouldn't say a word to me. Lately, all I ever feel is just you don't care that you lost me. What's wrong with you? I had a picture of you sitting in the dash in the car with me. Now it's in the closet with the other one sitting in a box. I don't want to open up. You took it all from me. Told me you would die for me. Yeah, all you ever did is lie to me. Wishes I could say that this has come as a surprise to me. Told me that I never took the time and now you ain't got no time for me. What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? <laughs> this kid looks like a Christmas tree. Hey, who's texting your mom? Like? Hey, who's calling you? What are you doing on your phone, bro? Hey, so do you know what you're doing for Christmas break yet? Probably just gonna be chilling. I mean, you know, the usual. How about you? Come on, you better get off. How long have you been to school? I've never seen you around. What are you doing? Yeah, uh, palm tree right here.
It's Friday, and I don't know about you, but I'm ready to munch. So let's check out Fun Food Friday. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell, jingle bell. <laughs> I like jingle bell, jingle bell rock. That's good. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Previously on Campus Live, Queen Bee, Tracy, and Jade the Innocent put their plan into action to catch Brandon in his lies. During their argument, Linda reveals that she has actually been letting the two fight over her man for personal entertainment. Remember warriors, there's always a wolf in sheep's clothing. It was really funny seeing Jade and Tracy fighting over my man. I thought it was like a little crush, but it just got a little extreme, so I had to stop it. It was just bad. So now that drama has been calmed between us, I think our aggression should be towards Brandon and Linda. They both like had us looking stupid. Brandon's not even that cute. Hello, we're sitting here. I just moved from Las Vegas. You said you're a new student from Las Vegas? Oh, well, welcome to Patriot High School. I'm Carter. Yes, Miss Carter, nice to meet you. So, we have a lot of stuff happening. We had a, you know, open mic, or not open mic, it was a poetry slam with uh, another teacher, Miss Cherry, held it and hosted it. So, if you do spoken word, you gotta see Miss Cherry. And then we have a wonderful website for all of our sports called phswarriors.com. Shout out to Mr. Marinzen. And he's the athletic director. Also, tomorrow, which is Thursday, we're having a silent night game and like carnival. It starts at 4.30. Who wants to take our new student, Ross, to the silent night game? I'll take him. I'll take him. Oh. Hello, my name is Ross. I'm a new kid here at Patriot High School. I just moved from Nevada, and so far, I really like it here. I even got um, asked to Saturday night, which is tomorrow, so it should be fun.
Sorry. week for campus life. I know I can't wait. Well, I got class clown. Our senior personality is most athletic. At Patriot, I play football, basketball, and baseball. And I've done cross country, soccer, and track.
Money Mondays. Christmas time.